Sorry. So sorry, so sorry I'm late. Documents I had to submit to my time. That one is your problem, so I'm already eating. Oh, you're not nice. What if I had died at work? Oh no, Mrs. Adam saying she will be the end of me. Is it not you that like being nice to that woman? So no, she can't try that rubbish with me. With you, you that she reduced your salary last month. Oh, I'm hungry. Where should you get food? Who I already you? ordered. Don't worry, they're bringing your food. Ah, big G. <laughs> Thank you. God. Okay. There's a guy over this there, just since you walked in. Okay. And so? So? It's funny, guy. Hello. My name is Michael Obiago. I noticed how you ladies are uh, lively, so I thought I should come share in what you're celebrating and say hi. Probably we can become friends, and if I am lucky, I can get a number. Okay, my name is Gina. This is my friend Kate. Kate? And of course, you can get a phone number. Gina, so who's you want? Okay, let me just call out the number for you. Okay, a minute. Yes. 080 080 So this is where I stay. Okay. Thank you so much for the ride. Thank you also for giving me the opportunity to drive you home. Good night. I'll call you. Yeah, sure. Yep. coming back I'm starving let's hope he comes back if not we will die of hunger oh what do you think the time is I think it's past 10 oh he should hurry and come back because me I'm starving Dad! Dad! Mm, how are you? Fine. Hi. Dad? Mm. Why are you late? Yes. And did you buy food? Because I'm starving. Me oh, too. Sorry, I was able to get food for you. No, I was able to get you um, one more bread. Thank you, Dad. You can have it. It. Let's share it. I don't even know why I have it. Hey, 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 hey! should stop it. Okay? We can eat together and um, show love to one another. You don't have to drag your food. Stop it. Uh, eat, eat, eat. Yeah. 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 Lynn!
straight no matter how long it takes you're going to be fine Dad, this mama is sweet too. Do you know why it's from that woman at the junction? Yes. Dad, how was your day at work? Disappointing. Why? They didn't let me see the manager. Do you want my moi moi and bread? Oh, yeah, give me this Oh, leave me, Tina. <gasps> Dad, Magdalene mm -hmm. won't leave my dinner. Please. Magda. You have put your... Give me your own, you have put huh, your hand on my own. Hey, give you both. Hey, 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 hey. Be careful so you don't choke. Behave. Wake up, girls. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Nay. Magda. Oh, yeah, get up, get up. Time to go. Is it day yet? Yes. <sighs> we have nothing to do for you, so why are we getting up? Listen, get up. Pack your stuff. We are going to see someone. What kind of stuff? And we haven't bathed in two days. And who cares? I do. Oh. I smell like fish. Just to confirm. I mean. Dad, I hear it's unkept. You know you're always looking to me. You know you do, you make use of all of my heart, okay? Just get to pack your stuff, your shoes, your bag. You know how you do it when going to Aunt Sheila's place, right? But Aunt Sheila is married. And on our honeymoon. I know. But this time around, we are going to see someone else. Who? Your new mom. New mom? Then I'm not going like this. First impression matters. Ah, uh, not today, Martha. I don't have time to play dress up. But we're supposed to see mom today. Was it supposed to be today? Yes. She asked to see us. Remember? Okay, um, it's fine. 
Yes, I'm going to do it. We'll draw by to see more, and afterwards we head to our final destination. Is that okay? So, let's go. Fast, fast, fast. Speed, 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 speed. Don't keep me waiting. Uh, <laughs> you can make it of the party. Don't keep me waiting, girls. This girl say, Mary Lynn, Magdalene, Lynn. Be fast now, we are running late now. Okay, let me see, let me have it. Let me see. Take, 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 take. Mary, come. So you look good, okay? Come, let me see. Don't get trouble. You're fine, you're fine. Let's go, we are running late, okay? Hey, baby girl! I'm, so I'm fine. How are you? You look all smiley today. What happened? Of course, a woman smiling means something great has happened to her. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh! Who proposed? I thought mm. you were single. I know, right? Well, it just happened. He proposed and I said yes. Jesus, this is so beautiful. Let me Thank see. you so much, baby. Thank it's so you. surprising. Just like that. Just say your baby's a very sharp girl. You know now. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. Thank you. What? You know, I just wish I could find a man to call mine someday. Of course you'll find a man. Your man is coming. Okay? I ain't get like you. <laughs> or maybe I'm not just a wife material. Stop saying that. Stop it, okay? I'm sorry, forgive me. This is not about... Today's all about crying and, you know, it's about of celebrating course. you. Yeah, let's I mean, celebrate. That's what it is. I have babe. to take you out. You need to tell me all about that man. Of course. So where are we going to? Hold on, let me just get ready, pack my stuff. Have your babes. <laughs> it was so very funny.
We are good. What do you think? Huh? We are better off without you. So stop being so nice. Not the... It's okay, Lin. I understand that anger. It's okay. Oh, you do? So, how about I vent it all out here? Like, right now? <laughs> Can you me? stop? She's still our mother. Mother, mother, mother. She's not my mother. My mother would not abandon me. She would never leave us to go live the way she wants. She would never have called us names and treated us like burdens. Or even divorced dad. She would never have pushed me so hard that I, I broke my arm. Only so she could spend time with men. And now that she's supposedly dying, she has miraculously become nice. I'm sorry, but we don't need you anymore. We have a new mom. So you can go and continue living your wayward life. Who's there? I'm coming. Hey, kids, come, 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 come. Um, I wanted to tell you. Um, What's up? Something came up. I thought I should stop by and see you. What happened? Come, come in. I really can't, but they can. Who? Girls, come, 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 come. Yes. Girls? First, come join me. Magda, come here. Come, 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 come. Take. You take. You take this. I'm right behind you, go. Fast, 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 fast. What is going on? Um, I'll, I'll come back and pick them up and I'll explain everything when I'm back, okay? Wait, wait, wait. Michael, please. Why? Who are they? Thanks, Kitty. Bye. Bye, Dad. Dad? Hello. 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 You are very beautiful, so. Hello. Your house is beautiful. So beautiful. Thank you. So, um, what can I get you girls? Water is fine. I I've been thirsty for so long. And you can sprinkle some food too. Sure. Oh, what's the smell? Is it your boot? I, I, I hope it is. <laughs> A lot of things smell in us. I don't understand what... Um... If you don't mind, can we take our bath and freshen up first? Yes, today will be the second day we haven't taken our bath because we didn't have water yesterday. Yes, Dad was too busy to get us water. Um, okay. Fine, just, just take your boots outside. Please keep your boots outside and come inside, please. Please don't kill me. Oh, 
You didn't even leave your boy dead. Yeah. Oh, sorry, girl. Why is my camera picking his calls now? What kind of rubbish is this? Hey, you felt that. Hey, that my um, um, Excuse me, um, Magdalene, why did you eat here, not the dining table? And why didn't you guys clear the table after eating? I don't understand. How do you mean? What I mean is, after you finish eating, you're expected to clear the table before you eat. Why didn't you do it? We, we don't clean where we eat. Ah, wow. So who does that for you then? Dad does it. Or sometimes we leave it till he's ready to clean it. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, you see, in this house, we clean up the table after eating. So take this to the kitchen now. Okay, you, you, you can't clean it. Are you serious right now? Listen to me, you two. I don't care what kind of trainings you have. But in this house, we walk and clean up after ourselves, okay? Take it to the kitchen now! Move! What kind of rubbish is this? This man, I beg, pick your call. I'm tired of these kids. Gosh. How is he network? How many hours will he continue to be network? I've been calling him. Gina, what if he has abandoned me with them? I barely even know this man. I just met him recently and now he's dumping me with two teenage girls that 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 that, that know absolutely nothing about life. Clueless, ill-mannered, not well trained. Gina, I have a lot going for me right now. I, the, the last stress I want in my life is two teenage girls that are dressed like boys. Oh, God. Kate, just breathe and sleep. I believe by morning he'll call you, okay? Okay. So beautiful. I love your hair. Oh, thank you so much, darling. So you girls be good, okay? Don't touch anything. Don't do anything and do not break anything. Just sit down and watch TV. I made lunch so you can eat when you're hungry. I'll be back home early, hopefully. Okay, mom. Um, I wonder why your father is not picking his calls. Did he tell you how long he'll be gone for? Nope. But this is not the first time this is happening. Yes, he does this every time. Um, ever since we were three. He would drop us off and disappear sometime. For like two weeks, one week, or even more. You're back early, mm -hmm. and you still look beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Um, quick question. How do you know when the gas is on or off? What do you mean? Uh, Magda, I don't know if the gas is too on. What?
Oh my God, oh my God. I told you girls, I told you girls before I left the house. I said do not touch anything, do not touch anything. Just sit down and watch TV. I made food, eat when you're hungry. Gosh, I went to cook despite knowing that you don't know how to use the gas. Imagine you burnt my house down or worse died in my house. What would I have told everybody? Please, if I should just pick up this call and come and pick your girls and just, just take you away because I am tired. Please. We are sorry. Sorry for yourselves. Hello, Michael. You finally decided to call back after 50 years of calling you. I am really sorry, Kate. I sincerely apologize for my sudden behavior. I will explain everything to you tomorrow when I come. Please. So, how are you and the girls? Oh, you mean the children you gave birth to without giving them any manual on how to navigate life? I'm sure they're doing a great job ruining my life. There's really too much going on for me. I don't know how to explain it. I can barely manage my life and them. It's too much for me. Here is newsflash. You're living with them tomorrow. I've had enough of them. Okay, that's not a problem. It's okay by me. I'm fine with it. Okay, Kate, meanwhile, how have you been? Talk to me. I'm interested. Just tell me. Baby, talk to me now. Please. Yes. I have sent you this picture of the girl's pictures. His name is Michael Obiago. Track him. Find out where my girls are. No woman will take my place in their lives. Mm. We don't go to school. Yes, we are homeschooled. Why? Um. Dad was too busy to balance work and us. So he thought that if he taught us himself, then it would be easier for him until he sorted things out. Unfortunately, it has been six years and we're still homeschooled and he hasn't been able to balance things. He barely teaches us anymore too. You know, he's still trying to fend for us. Thanks, Mom. Um, wait, please. Why don't you call me Mom? Where's your mom? Uh, Let's just say she does not exist. What? Um, no. She's ill. And she might not make it. My. Wow, I'm, I'm so sorry. What type of sickness is that? We don't know. The doctor wouldn't tell us. I know. You do? Yes. I overheard Dad and the doctor speaking. So I decided to look it up online on dad's phone. She has HIV and AIDS. What? The type that killed her sister? Yes. Um. Wow, girls, I... <laughs> I'm so sorry you are going through this. No need. It's not like she cared anyways. Yes. No parental love from her. Plus dad. She's so busy. But dad is way better than her. Mom is like a zero out of hundred. She doesn't care at all. I... I'm sorry, I... I just don't know what to say. I... It's okay. We're going to be fine. I trust God. No, 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 it's fine. Just eat. It's okay. Okay, you eat it, it's fine. It's okay. I'm fine, I'm full. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Why are you messy? Let me. No. Let's help you do it. Yes, let's help you clean up. Okay. <laughs> wow. I'll take the cut later. Okay.
Doesn't your beanie ever come off? Don't! Please don't take it off. <laughs> okay, you say so. You can I take yourself? Oh, oh, oh no. Please. Have you girls had your bath today? Uh, um, well, I'm not. Why? Oh, yeah. Let me uh, we are not ready yet. Did you have your bath yesterday? Hmm? Hmm? That's what I thought. You see, in this house, we have our baths minimum twice a day. Okay? Oh, yeah. Now, go upstairs. Go and have your bath. <laughs> we are not ready yet. Now! Stand up. I'll take off your video. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Go off. Now. Those girls have not driven you crazy. Mm -hmm. um, I'm still saying. So where are they? Mm -hmm. Upstairs doing God knows what. Has he called you yet? Yeah, yeah. He's coming to take them today. Thank goodness. Listen, make sure you return them back to him and don't consider dating him anymore. Can you imagine dumping two teenagers in front of a single woman's doorstep and running away? What is single daddy self? Awala is too much. He's not that bad actually. He's sweet. Ha! Hey! Wait, 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 are you serious? Same you that was saying, how could he do this to me? He's not saying that he's sweet. See women, ordinary small phone call like this. <laughs> You're already planning a future with ordinary me. Ordinary small phone call, I beg you, don't kill me. I bet what can, you, what can I give you? I want to eat, Jerry. I'm hungry. We get to my house to eat. Yes, I want to eat food. I'm coming. Who is it? I'm coming. Dad, you said you were coming later, and it's been two days. I'm sorry. Dad, did you get anything? No. I'm sorry. I missed you. I am divorced. I married the mother Rose after she took him for me. She wasn't the ideal woman for me. Yeah, I knew she did escort service. And it was supposed to be a fling. It happened. And we ended up together. Our marriage wasn't the sweetest. In fact, it wasn't even close to being sweet. She would nag all the time. She even blackmailed me emotionally for forcing her into the marriage. And after she had, she had put to bed, three years later after giving birth to Marilyn and Magdalene. She threatened me with leaving the marriage. I tried convincing her to stay.
interested, but she was spending my money lavishly on younger boys. She did that so much that at some point, someone thought I, I felt like, okay, should I let her go? Well, looking at it realistically, I couldn't. How, how can I survive as a single parent? What about my kids? Oh, my girls grew up without a mother. I had to put up with it. But she continued. She intensified the cheating. She cheated. Even more just to spite me. So, Sunday, she packed up. She said she was leaving. She was no more interested in the marriage anymore. I tried telling her to stay. But she left. She was in and out of my girl's life for like six years. And suddenly she appeared someday filing for a divorce. That was when everything came crashing. She requested for money. So much money I would give her. Then she became so greedy. But she would demand for even more. I couldn't afford. Had to let her go. I obliged. This became unstable for me with work. I got fired taking care of my girls. I had to raise my girls. I lost my job. After losing my job, I ran low on finance. I had to cater for my girls. I had to give them everything they deserve. It wasn't easy. They eat all the time and don't fall sick. Things became unstable for me with work, but I got fired. I lost my job taking care of my girls. Nobody was going to do it for me. I love my girls so much that I would do anything for them. I ran loan finances. Trying to raise them. They eat so much and they fall sick. It wasn't easy for me. Things became very difficult for me. So the following year, we couldn't afford to continue where we were staying. We moved to a sub up area. I sold everything I had. Just to get out for my girls. They couldn't even, I couldn't even afford for their education anymore. They weren't going to school. And that was why I brought them to you. Because I had a gig. Which wasn't fruitful. I lost it. I lost the gig. Because when I came here meeting them, I couldn't even get them anything. It's okay. I'm sorry you had to go through all that. I'm here now, okay? How can I help? 
You have time for that as well. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so sorry that it's okay. Right. Right. okay. Yeah, so if you explain to them that this is what you're bringing to them without showing them images, I'm sure this would be enough to grant you hearing. Then afterwards you could um, do a proper presentation for the manager. Hopefully this works. Your intelligence. Thank you. Um, I really should get going. It's getting late. Why? You could actually pass a nice year if you want, you know. As much as I would love to, I have to go prepare for tomorrow. Yeah, that's fine. Just call me when you get home, okay? Yeah, sure, I will. Thank you. Girls, daddy's leaving. Dogs. Mm, my angels. Do you have to go? I have to go prepare for tomorrow. So you promise me that you won't stress, Kate? We won't, Dad. We won't. Promise me. Promise. So promise. I promise you, Dad. I promise you, Dad. <laughs> I'm sure that will stress you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate you. Um, okay. So, come see me. Okay. So, would have been from the box. Go to bed. It's really late. Should we take her to her room? No. Not yet. What are you doing? Oh, it's typing and documentation. Dad does it sometimes. Okay, then let me call it out. Then you can type it. That way it will be faster. Okay. Patrick Eden for a name. And his email patrick at gmail.com. Are you sure it's correct? Yes. Felt it. Next. 
what happened? I thought you returned them. I don't understand. Why are you doing your face like that? So you agreed to return them now? Well, they are still with me. Wait, Kate, are you still keeping those girls? I don't know. Omojina, they almost burned down my house um, when I left them alone. Are you serious? Well, on the good side, they helped me work last night, so... Mama, I feel like you're just creating more problems for yourself every day. You just have to return them, all right? <laughs> so, enter! Oh my god. What is this? What's going on here? Is your wardrobe bad? Where? Here! Why are your clothes not folded? What happened? Someone robbed you? Uh -huh. The truth is that we don't know anything about arranging our clothes or packing. So we just dropped them anywhere we see. Okay, get up. I'll show you. So you. Fold your neat clothes. And you separate your neat clothes from your dirty clothes. These are your neat clothes, right? Watch me. Good. Yeah, so um, you just go in, bring your skirts, your trousers, your blouse, you know, everything, your dresses, just fold them, <laughs> put them in the wardrobe. Uh, we, we don't have those. So what's up with you and the girls? It's been great, Gina. I swear, like, the girls have totally transformed. I mean, it's not been easy, but they're way better than they came. You know, to top it all, we even cooked last night. Dinner was great. It was great watching them having to, you know, try to cook, put on the gas, use the blender. <laughs> they're really good on me. Wow. Well, I'm so happy you guys are getting along so easily. Mm -hmm. So. Does that mean you and their father are going to? Um, I do not know about that. <laughs> yeah. Mm. So I can't say much. I like him, but I don't know. He, his girls have totally grown on me. Well, you really have to think about him. Like, you really have to think about it. Mm. Wise man! Only fools rush in, but I can't help falling in love with. Who is singing that song? Who? Who is singing that song? Why sing that song? Why? Our dad used to sing it. That's your father. I don't want to hear that song anywhere near me. Not in my house. Not anywhere near me. Ever. What is wrong with you? I'm sorry. Sorry. Just stop! Stop!
Sorry, is this Mr. Thomas' house? Mom? Someone is looking for you. I'm here already. Hello. Hello. Please, I'm asking if this is Mr. Thomas' compound. No, it's not. How may I help you? Thank you. I'm so sorry for disturbing you. Okay. She lives at Simple's Close. Your daughters are there, but I did not see Michael. Michael is not my problem. I also found some interesting information about her that you would find very useful. Come in. Hi, Mom. Uh, we got you something. Yes. We noticed you've been down for the past week and you barely talk or even smile. So we got you something. Okay. It's colorful. I hope it makes you happy, because I really don't like seeing you sad. Oh. No. It's fine. It's okay. Just check the top drawer. You'd find fish line or glue to put the beads together. What is this? You are married. Give me that. How? Um. So, so you are lying to us? No, 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 girls. It's, it's, it's not so much thing. Just let me explain, okay? Just, just please, come and sit down. Just sit down, okay? Please. Please just sit down and let me explain. So that's what I have been dealing with. I take antidepressants day and night. Just to make me focus, you know, just to help me heal, bring me out of depression. But it feels like it never works. To both of you here, I feel better. I really just want a mother. I want to know what it feels like for someone to wait for me with unconditional love. And I saw that in you, and I really want you to be our mom. I'm sorry for everything you've been through, but we're here now, and you're going to be okay. Yes, I will always be here. We love you. I love you guys too. Mm -hmm. Can I call you mom? Of course, as much as you want. <laughs> mom. <laughs> <laughs>
girls, I'm home. Mom! Mom! Welcome back home. Welcome back home. Quick question, why do you guys wear milk clothes that are oversized? Oh, we outgrow our clothes over time. And Dad didn't have money or time to get us new ones, so he handed down his own to us, and we had to mend them a little bit, but we got used to them over time. But do you like wearing them? <laughs> no. I'm actually a fashion type, but Dad is clueless, and we didn't want to pressure him. I don't like it either, but it's all we know how to wear. Well, I guess we're cool then. <laughs> Thank you, Mom. Thank you, Mom. So pretty. Okay, so we're going to start with hair washing. No. Why? Are you bold? It's just that. Just what? Oh my. <laughs> it stinks. <laughs> you, you should see mine too. Wow. Okay. We're going to need more shampoos. As a matter of fact, I'm bringing in a whole salon. What? Nah, we've got a lot of work to do. Thank you. Hey, Dad. Magda! Oh, wait, what's going on here? He looks stunning. <laughs> How? When? What happened? Today, Dad. Today. Girls, who's at the door? It's so good to see you. Upset you? Come on, please speak to me. You didn't do anything wrong, Michael. It's just. I've been doing a lot of thinking lately. And what are you thinking of? This. this whole relationship thing. I don't think I can do it. I don't think I'm ready for it. I don't think I'm ready to cherish someone that may leave tomorrow. I've had bad relationships in the past and I'm scared. Shh, stop talking. Just stop. I am here now. I am here for you. I love you. I love you with everything in me. It's okay to be scared. It's okay to be uncertain. I just want you to know that I'll always be there for you. I am never leaving you. My heart beats for you. Okay? <laughs> okay, keep. 
Mm. Keep my shoes off. Mm. Give off my shoes. You have to be fast. You can't be slow. Mm -hmm. okay. Drop. Drop me off. Drop you off where? <laughs> okay, yeah. Alright, okay, let's continue. Let's continue to where? No, not like that. No, like let's continue the game. Oh. Okay, um, baby. I love you, baby. Oh, I love you too, baby. Ah, it's okay. Oh, God. Why are you jealous? Is he your baby? Okay, let's continue. Um, R, Dad, are you not supposed to be somewhere? To where? Oh, mm, I forgot. <laughs> I just you were like still I playing just the game. Your game. I have to leave. <laughs> uh, it's actually late. Okay. I'll tell your daddy. Good okay. night. Bye, Dad. Take care of yourself, okay? Bye, Dad. Yeah, take care of yourself. Bye, okay? Take care of yourself, okay? No. Yeah. I'll miss you all. Good you too, too. Thank you, you too. Take care, Dad. You too. Calm down, Tiger. Calm down. I heard the love of your life is married. I have my ways. I sent you a little gift on WhatsApp. <laughs> Michael. Babe, did you forget something? Yes, oh, my daughter's. Now go get your things. Go where? Why? Will you go get your things? Let's leave. Babe, babe, please talk to me. I don't understand. What is going on? Why are you taking them? First off, do not baby me again. Secondly, they are my children. And I will do with them how I wish. So now go get your things. Dad, we don't want to Will go. you shut up and move? Mom, please do something. We don't want to go. I don't want you to go. So I don't know what is wrong with your father, Michael. Please, please don't. Don't lay your hands on me again. Don't try it. You will never ever see us in this house again. So now you go upstairs there and get your things to me. Let's leave. Michael, Michael, Mary, Michael, get out and look at Michael, come down. What am I doing? Will you forget your things to me? Michael, what is going on? Please calm down. Michael, what am I doing? Please, I love them so much. You can't take them away from me, Michael. Magda, lean.
before I forget, Marilyn. Wow, this is impressive. Okay, um, I'm off to work, okay? I'll see you soon. Hmm? These are now women. Thanks to Auntie Kate. Are you waiting? We are not hungry. Baby girl, forget about this man. You hear me? Don't take them seriously. Alright? Don't take them seriously. Take a good look at me. Me that they engaged some time ago. Have I not returned the ring? Look now, I have returned the ring. He doesn't know what he wants. Imagine giving me a ring at my age and asking me to wait two years. Kate. Two freaking years for him to fix his useless life. He's not okay. He wants to cause bad market for me and stop my actual suitors from meeting me. Or more, I return that ring ASAP. <laughs> no time to waste, so it's not my market that he will spoil. Baby girl, the bottom line is, I want you to cheer up. Be happy. Just forget about this whole thing. Okay? Stop stressing your little head over this. You know I got you. Just die every thought. Die every thought of them, okay? My girls told me everything that happened, so I thought I should come apologize to you. I'm sorry I should have told you earlier, but I'd rather tell you now than lose the opportunity again. Calm down. 
calling me the you're calling me that he's not in church yet. Why? Why is he not in church yet? Why? Stop Why is he not yourself. calling me? Why is he not calling me? Let me call him. Maybe he got caught up in traffic or something. Give no, me your phone. no. Give me my phone. Calm down. Relax. Just breathe. Gina, people are threatening to leave the church. People are threatening to leave the church. What am, I, what am I going to do? Where is James? He'll be in church soon. Okay? Calm down. Relax. You're ruining your makeup. Stop crying. That's ridiculous. Oh my god, baby, baby. Okay. What happened? You should be in charge. Yeah, just. Why are you guys calm here? Calm down, what? calm down. See, I have given this a lot of thought and. I'm sorry, kid, I don't think I can go through with this. Yeah, I've been trying to tell you how I feel for a long time now, but you've been too excited to hear me out. I know this must hurt and it's not my intention to hurt you, but it's rather now than later. Think of the idea of being married to one woman for the rest of my life. Kid, I don't think I'm ready for that kind of long, forever journey right now. James. I'm so sorry. James, no. James, please. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. I'm so sorry, okay? James, please. James! Mm. Sit down. It's okay. It's okay. The picture you saw was one of the pictures I took when I was with James before he jilted me. I couldn't let go of our four years relationship. So I kept the picture to remind me of the worst day of my life. I'm sorry for what you went through. And I am sorry for not being different. And for leaving you when it mattered the most. It actually mattered to I and my kids. And we love you. Yes. And I promise to never leave your side again, baby. Okay? That's if you forgive me and don't kick me out. I forgive you. I forgive you. And I... I also got the job with the real estate company. Really? Yes, all thanks to you. Congratulations! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You made it happen, actually. My phone, sorry, excuse me. My phone. Spring game, who's this? Hello? Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, I'll be there. I'll be right there. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. All of us? Yes, all of us. Let's um, go. Please. Okay, let me get my phone. I'm coming. like them that much. I just couldn't stand another woman. Raise my daughters. And you've proven to raise them well in this short time that they've known you. I was just jealous. I was jealous of your healthy life, your job, and good parenting. But my daughters my daughters love you so much. It's okay, please. I 
totally understand. I mean, I would have done the same if I were in your shoes. She's about to die. Even if she's going to die, I don't care. And trust me, I won't cry. I know she doesn't love us, but she's still our mother. Giving birth. Does not make you a mother. Yes. Yes, ma'am. I know there is no form of apology that will heal you girls from what I did to you. I don't even know what to say right now. Except that this might get place in your in your pile. And forgive me. I, I forgive you, Mom. I forgive you. Not that. I forgive you. Yes. 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 Is she gone? Yes. You think so? Oh, I... yes. Her eyes are open. Time of death, 2.21 p.m. She's really gone. I said I was not going to cry. <laughs> 